Did back, they're going to go towards the safe site where there is only one player, but that is Mertz with the AWP. He's also got to watch down short, though. This is the big problem in the setup right now for North. Yeah. With a man down, Mertz is left alone, tasked with dealing with all four players of AGO. And this split's going to be so well timed. PHR is going to have a great angle to take down Mertz if he just keeps walking by. But the rotation is in, and Kierby has his back turned. Mertz swivels, oh, and what? he finds two with one shot. Doesn't need a scope. Only Snatchy left now, and somehow Mertz has made this possible. That's incredible! This is not a fun position to be in. Oh, right. Quick pop. Ooh, oh, my God. He's got one more to go. He's coming from Catwalk and Scream. He's... Oh, does he know? Does he realize? That, oh, he's out in the open. He's still alive. He's part of it. He goes for the engagement. Oh, too high with the crosshair. <laughs> it could have been great. But instead, it sucks. But do you know why, James? Because anything less than a success. Because Furlan's looking to do exactly that. He's looking to dive into middle to find an early pick. And oh, he may have just got past Valdi. I don't think Valdi spotted that. He might have just been behind the wall. This means Furlan can just completely topple this B defense. And they have no idea. Oh, no, no Furlan. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. And then, even despite it being traded, now the CTs are going to try to come back into this. And at least they know there is a man back here, right? AZ was spotted at the beginning of this. He's still trying to hold the line. He's oh no God. way. Come on. Spotting limbs of his own. So much damage being thrown out, chipping away here thanks to utility. Still the bomb is planted, but it does lead us to the 4v2. And again, AZ is alive. He's yet to die in the back of the bomb site where he has continued to hide and still he finds success here. How has AZ managed to get himself at the end of this round? Okay, my question is why the hell are you bomb planting when you still have a player on the site? Like you could advantage. The Mac 10 wasn't picked up. Oh, that's very nice position for Scream. Not expecting oh. so many to be there. But he's wiped out almost everyone. Rubino one versus four. So many weapons to collect on the rotation as well. Oh my god, Scream. He got he gets two, goes back for the well. And oh what a way to <laughs> what a way to lose the map. That is crushing. Scream doing what Scream does. Definitely seeing a new life from Ooh, hello. Deagles. Deagles. Another one. This is a bit scary now for Ruby. You know he's out here in the open, and there's a, a huge swath of pistol players ready to go and fight. Nico, not a fan of Toes. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, what is it with these deagles? Three kills for Scream, three versus one. They can't pick up the guns just yet for the most part because they are around main, but that's the only saving grace for Moddy. Scream's got an AK, and that will be headshot number four getting amped up from the crowd as well. Oh man, you got you got to respect that. That is vintage scream right there. What is the call? What is the play for Heroic? They've got an AWP on somebody. And CZ's spread amongst the rest of the team. Deagle out onto Freiburg. Kevlar's all around except for Moddy, so... Ooh, ouch. Oh my god, that hurts as well. <laughs> Two AWP shots through the wall. Great oh, oh, and then the third one through the wall. Flickerino. In the, in the heads. That is, Modi, he was just supposed to die this round. I don't, I, what else? Yeah. I, was like, yeah, I didn't realize it was a proper match. Ah, uh, there's the forest eyebrow. Oh, both. He's way too good at that. The eyebrow wave is actually very difficult. I can do the eyebrow raise, but I can't, yeah. I can't do the other side. <laughs> yeah, I can't do People it. You know when you're in the mirror and you're like, uh, 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 and you just look like de <laughs> demented or something? There's a lot of the out of control, there, isn't it? He did it. He did the heart. <laughs> See? They love it. And there's the crowd. That's the reaction. That's what Khan did. In, in come over. Anybody could just go flying through smoke in this instant. It's going to come down to the mow down. And Hobbit, well, he's going to start this off. Adren comes peering out from heaven. And whoa, that's going to cost him. But Doja's still alive. And there's 10 seconds back left on the clock. Whoa. Doja continues to spray. And he's not going to get them all. But the plant, the plant, Shazam, he's flubbed it. And there you have it. Gambit, pick up map one. <laughs> oh, what a way to lose. You do hate to see it, Connor. Gambit with a fantastic finishing round and Dosia such good job. Center не получается, пока что нормально пройти. Наконец-то есть минус против Рейна, он пытается идти обратно. Тут опорники один и второй Кроумен неплохо стреляет против одного соперника, но все-таки тут еще будет помощь от Гардиана. Керриган забирает только еще одного соперника, ну и вот он выход от команды Mouse Sports. Нико последний пытается ворваться на малые пески и тут же его забирает Крис Джей. Трипл килл от капитана команды Mouse Sports 1-0. Невероятно четкий спокойный выход со стороны шарта от Маузов делает все от начала до конца качественно. Парнейшая, соответственно, защите вообще здесь нечего было делать, несмотря на усиление на Апланте. И сейчас мы посмотрим на паримачевские 
эм, коэффициенты на конкретно эту карту. Напомню, что ей пикнули Мау Спортс, поэтому э, здесь шансы у них достаточно неплохие. 1.97 к 1.77. Соглашусь с тобой. Смотрим на форс команды Фейс Клан, скаут от Гардиана. Работа уже на центре. Тут, кстати, уже заметил одного противника. Это был Натан, который а, прошел направо. Ну и, собственно, команда Моу Спортс играет крайне закрыто в этом а, раунде, потому что боится ЦЗшек, боится вот пушить с гранатами. At B apartments, they weren't sure if people were hiding or what. That's a nice shot from Kiyoshima. Oh! What is this? Five versus two. This is ridiculous. There's no answer from Hero just yet. He continues to charge another headshot. Are you serious, Kiyoshima? Modi one versus four after four. Gone with a different MVP. But this is where I want to really test whether or not this graphics guy can do it. Because my MVP would obviously be Sixer from Envious, <laughs> because he's the only man who could contain and neutralize Kiyoshima. By and the he power of TV invested you know, in Thorin. He was the MVP for Heroic. You know, See? it turns out they had a sleeper agent the whole time. He's going to gut you with that knife. Yeah, he'd miss. <laughs> he'd go for the left click with that and miss, wouldn't he? So <laughs> I'd diffuse in the smoke and he'd be, <laughs> he'd be in there doing that. We did. Не выйдет, нет, отойдет обратно. Ну, я не знаю, стоит ли им вообще, в принципе, здесь нарываться. То есть, кому нужно выйти против пистолета в close дистанцию? Может быть, фейзам только, если там показать то, что они мужики, или я не знаю, mm -hmm. что они готовы тут выламывать лица. Такое ну, себе. Тут уклон на Сани, который попытается выйти на дистанцию с Диглом. Кстати, ковры тоже подключаются команды Mouse Sports, Guardians, VP на 15. Позиция хорошая, чтобы убить соперника, но если Асани отлетает, то тут уже появляются небольшие шансы. У команды Моу Спорт пройти дальше. О, попадание Гардиан в итоге. Э, вот 58 хп нужно просто отходить. Рейн, большие пески тоже неплохо контролятся здесь. Э, выход через ковры. Ну вот та самая флешка должна полететь от Натнинга. Мы а, это ждем. А может быть это зуб за зуб, эко за эко? Сейчас от Моузов, потому что реально можно вернуть и мораль, и силу, и раунды, и деньги. И Робс выходит первым, получает больше вместе со стика. Кроман, заход на шорт, нампинг падает. И Крис Джей остается один. Ему останется только погибать. Oh. Хэдшот, кстати, повесил. Гардин осталось всего 7 хп. Благо, арморчик купил шапку. И в коннекторе в итоге остается команда Фейс разыгрывает очень долгий этот раунд. После размена хорошего для себя потеряли только одного крома на Керриган на выходе через мейн. Рейн уже на хайве я тоже показал себя, но информация по коннектору. Крис Джей забирает Керригана, это тоже очень важно. Он на погрузчике. Выход Рейн. Это было очень опасно. У, -у, -у Крис забирает еще его. И тут же перенаправление вектора. Атаки на точку Б. Никой Гардиан. Два ковача, два супер монстра вышли на эту позицию, будут да, ставить бомбу. Просто. Да. просто я скажу, тут без шансов для Моузов, только есть Крис Де Йонг сделает эйс, возможно. А так, есть молики, есть флешки у фейзов. Что касается этих фускитов, у Моузов тоже присутствует, также еще и смог есть. Так что должно им помочь. Проблема лишь в том, что тут реально два столпа, которые не дадут тебе вообще ничего сделать. Только если супер шикарно, вместе, синергично, одновременно сыграете. Тогда, может быть, что-то получится, но пока это выглядит не таким образом. Mm. Ника, но no Скоп. Это просто разрыв леса для Криса Де Йонга, Нафинга и Сани. И Нафинг сейчас спрашивает себя, куда я вообще попал? За что вы так со мной? Right, we ready? This is Summer, right? He's down mid in Dust 2 right now. He's got the AK in hand. One man up on side. Is he going to be able to take him? It's simple. He's pretty easy to take, frankly. There's only three in mid. He's taking down the first one. Can he get the second AK? Oh, no! He's gone down to somebody. Summer with a brilliant shot, simple. And Screeble finishes second one off. Summer's the last man standing. And Team West, they're tall. That's some try-hard stuff right there. Some people just try too hard, James, don't they? Drugs are bad. Try too hard. Wow. Looks uh, like normality's I'm, been restored. Guys, I'm just saying, oh, step out. All right? Do I'm better. There. I love you. WP at close range, and it looks like we might be at the end of the line here, unless something can be done, and no, it can't. Envy popping off for that one. They have made it through to the semi-finals of the Counter-Strike Asia Championships. Congratulations to Sixer and Co. Really back and forth match between the two sides but they've made it yeah it's going to feel great to get onto the stage and uh, to actually get some w's in the bag obviously the next matchup will be against navi that's a tough one that's a really really tough one but we won't see that today envious get the chance to really revel in that win and also build 
on on the success and look to all of the leaks in their gameplay because there were some there's a lot of basic stuff that they can fix you know when we're looking at you know some of those uh, anti force by anti come on dude over here get out of the way mongoloid Jesus, oh my god. my god! Holy shit! You popped the